Hello everyone, Something Duck 2, welcome to another mod review, this time on Crazy Creepers. A mod simply adds in additional creeper mobs, from diamonds to enchanting to TNT ones to water and more. So, we've got obviously the multitude of creepers here, and we'll just spawn them in and see what happens. Uh, I may want to keep inventory here, because I know that I'm not going to have this stuff on me, and since we're showing multiple, probably a good idea. So, I'm not going to bother about my health or hunger, it'll completely reset anyway, so I've got Molten, which will do that, and just has lava appear, don't know where we've gone now, there we go. So it's got lava that just appears like so, so if you need access to lava you can, or just obviously, um, you know, avoid it in many other necessary situations. Don't know how that... Ah, okay, so it okay, just got on top of the other. Alright then. That should go away soon, hopefully. Okay, there we go. Got Diamond Creeper, which I don't know what that does exactly. They just give you a few diamonds, and then maybe a chance to... Uh, of course it's gonna happen. Um, so they give you a few diamonds and explode. I don't think they explode the diamonds though. And maybe they're a more rare one that doesn't spawn as often. That uh, would be my guess. Uh, we'll move on to the next one of course. Which is healing. So I don't know if that means that... Okay, so it's just supposed to give you regeneration. Not instant health I don't think. So that's interesting. Um, let's see, what does it actually say? Heals you. Okay, cool. So. There's that. Uh, iron, which is another resource one it seems, which apparently just explodes and gives you iron ingots. Well, alright. Um, okay, so we we'll just do that. Yeah, I'm just gonna let those burn because they're not gonna do much. Oh boy, there's another one. Um, so we've got how many iron ingots here? Uh, five. Assuming probably five to eight or something. Like the diamond one, I guess. Yes, can you go away? Thanks, that'd be great. Oh, interesting, so you still get attacked as like a flame. Okay. But yeah, that made no sense. Obviously you still get flames or something, and that were the initial attack. Uh, it's not just because you're standing in their lava that they've created. Alright. So we got lightning, which is next. Okay, now we've got two more iron. That's weird. How we got behind there? Okay, sure. So maybe seven or eight. Um, so lightning. We've got it where obviously they will just strike lightning. They're not a charged creeper or anything. So there is that. Let's just fill in a fair amount of this then, sure, so we can get back up. Uh, we've got Ender Creeper, which I'm assuming is going to teleport us somewhere, maybe? Uh, maybe they teleport? I'm curious. Mm, not even the blocks, I'm confused. Uh, no, 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 no. Not sure there. Uh, Aqueous. Which is just a water creeper, I assume. It just spawns water, similar to the lava one. Obviously, the opposite. Got a mutant, which is. Whoa, okay. Whoa, alright, so it actually is. Mutant one, so it's just a giant, like the zombie, but a creeper, not the uh, mutant one from like the mutants mod, of course. Um, wasn't sure what it would be. So, yeah. Okay, so they do that. And if we get iron over here as well, maybe we've got equivalent of ten or nine iron. All right. Um, I might just spawn the mutant one elsewhere. So, to be honest, I don't even know how much damage they have. Or help me out. So. Can you, uh, can you, uh, notice me at all? Nothing? Alright, so can I get a bow in, for example? Okay, do that. Are you actually able to hit them? I don't think you can. Unless they're just like a testing one, I don't know. I don't know. I never know with hitboxes for some of these. Okay, so we go F3B. The head is a valid hitbox. Okay, 
go up here in creative then, because yeah, that's a bit odd. Um, so let's see, what do we got here? Anything? You just not to take that much damage at all? Or you, you know, arrows maybe? I don't know. Sword. Can't even get in the head at all. What? Don't know what happened there. Don't know if they're supposed to drop anything. Alrighty then. There's that. Uh, TNT. Which I assume is going to be obviously a massive explosion. And then yeah. No, I don't think many of these other ones are probably going to drop anything too amazing. Unless this is actually supposed to be a, you know, it drops TNT. Um, similar to the other resource ones we came across, like iron and diamond. What do you got here? Uh, you just launch a ton of it. And, yeah, cool. Great to know. Cool. And enchanting is what? Just that. So just a sort of effect. Chance worn armor. Oh, okay. Um, so I might just get I don't know, a diamond set or something. Just put that on and see what random enchantments gives me. Alrighty then. So what we got here? So we got okay, fire protection two and aqua affinity, protection two, protection three, and depth strata. Cool. I'm fine with that, it's a cool idea. Um so yeah, we'll just spawn in one of each of these again. Just to see what we get for actual drops, because I'm curious. Uh, mutants, I have no clue, but we'll get the others and just get like I don't know, powerful sword. Do I have a higher damage one? Not really. I've just got that. Okay. Um, so depth strider there. Enough. Come on, don't explode on me. Cool. So I don't know if they're supposed to like drop um, anything. I guess you go just the regeneration one. I don't think they're probably supposed to drop anything, they are just what they do. Um, and that's it, you're not getting like gunpowder from them still or anything. I had a guess. Um, I don't know what, what's your deal then. Alright. Yeah, most of it just seems like you just get XP from them because their actual purpose is more important, not drops. So, keep that in mind. Um, when going and out defeating them, I guess. Is it because you actually want them to drop stuff for you. Oh, we got 16 diamonds there. Cool. So, yeah, that is basically it. Uh, thanks so much for watching, and goodbye.